Hi, I'm Lucy, your narrator. Thanks for joining me for another video, and if this is your first time here, a very warm welcome to you. Before we get started, please kindly take a moment right now and click that subscribe button and notification bell so you can be alerted of every time I upload a new video. And also please watch this video to the end to see the preview trailer and some really nice behind the scenes photos. Leave Her to Heaven is a subscriber requested movie. Thank you Pop Star Boy for requesting that I do a video on this movie. I hope this video does your movie justice. This is a drama, film, noir, romance, and thriller movie. It was released in the USA in 1946 and it stars Gene Tierney, Cornel Wilde, and Gene Crane. And some of their co-stars were Vincent Price, Mary Phillips, Ray Collins, Gene Lockhart, Reed Hadley, Daryl Hickman, Chill Wills, Gertrude Astor, Paul Everton, and Jim Farley. This movie is about a writer falls in love with a young socialite and they're soon married, but her obsessive love for him threatens to be the undoing of them both as well as everyone around them. And now I've got some behind the scene tidbits for you. In 1944, after an intense bidding war, 20th Century Fox studio head Daryl Zanuck acquired the film rights to Ben Ames Williams' Leave Her to Heaven for $100,000, then an exorbitant price for an unpublished work. Later that year, Williams' mystery novel about one woman's obsessive love for her husband became one of the best-selling author's greatest successes, and by December 1945, Fox had released its film adaptation. Jean Tierney came close to missing out on the opportunity to play the iconic femme fatale Ellen Berendt. The role was initially offered to Rita Hayworth, who turned it down. Tierney was married to Olay Cassini, who designed the costumes for Leave Her to Heaven, as well as for a number of Tierney's other films of the 1940s and 50s. The two divorced in 1953. For the proposal scene, Cornel Wilde had trouble reacting convincingly to Jean Tierney's advances, but each time they did a take, the crew was so impressed they whistled at her. Finally, John M. Stahl said to Wilde, They all seem to understand how the scene should be played. Why can't you? And according to Daryl Hickman, who plays Danny, Richard's younger brother, Zanuck was so impressed when he viewed the rushes of the famous lake scene that he proclaimed it the greatest moment in all of film. He may have been on to something, Leave Her to Heaven became Fox's highest grossing film of the 1940s. And the famous and dramatic swimming scene that takes place in the lake for Daryl Hickman's character was in water so cold that the young actor caught pneumonia. The California filming locations included Bass Lake in the High Sierras, Monterey, and Bush Gardens. They also shot Ellen's first meetings with Richard and her father's memorial in Sedona, Arizona. Although most of the lake scenes were shot in Bush Gardens, a unit did film some long shots and other backgrounds in Warm Springs, Georgia. And it was Fox's highest grossing picture of the 1940s. Tierney earned an Oscar nomination for her role, but lost to Joan Crawford, who won for Mildred Pierce that year and it was cited by director Martin Scorsese as one of his favorite films of all time, and he assessed Jean Tierney as one of the most underrated actresses of the golden era. The baby, you'd love it. Well, I never wanted it. Richard and I never needed anything else. And now this. How can you say such wicked things? Sometimes the truth is wicked. 
The starring roles of Jean Tierney long ago revealed her as an incomparable dramatic artist, but in the part of Ellen in Lever to Heaven, she gives one of the truly great dramatic performances of our time. Of the devastatingly beautiful Ellen, it was said, she would cheat, lie, deceive, stop at nothing to make the man she loved her exclusive possession. With matchless dramatic power and romantic appeal, Cornell Wilde surpasses all his previous triumphs. As Richard Harlan, he fights his mad desire to marry Ellen. Now look here, Ellen. Darling, will you marry me? Why, you unpredictable little... Lovely Jean Crane discloses new emotional artistry that distinguishes her as one of our most talented actresses. As the gentle half-sister, not even she is spared the venom of Ellen's violent jealousy. What are you running away from? Is it me? Ellen, when we were kids, you used to torment me every way you could think of. You can't do that anymore. Is it Richard? If you must know, I'm going away because I can't stand living in this house any longer. The whole place is filled with hate. Your hate, not hate. Love, Ruth. Richard's love. For me. <laughs> If you like that one, we've got a lot more. Hotter than your morning coffee. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, I would greatly appreciate it if you would please kindly give me a like, comment below, share with others, subscribe to my channel, and click the notification bell to be alerted of every time I upload a new video. Please come back to see the next one. Until then, bye for now and be blessed.